What's up, guys? It just the semi-finals for OST just got revealed, and Ben Gay and Milikith are already playing. I don't know if this is fake, but um, I will put some music in the background. I just started my recording program because I was surprised by this. I didn't think they would play immediately. Uh, what, what music do I put? Let me just put some Zelda real quick. Yeah, no, not very professional here. So we see um, Ben Gay bought baton pass. Uh, I think his team. It's I think it's in his team building, not web shop. His page where his teams. I don't know what it's called again. And Maliki has brought this team that he used with his Lord Aldridge again with Z Slaps here, Salamo Kiran. He got a boost with uh, one of the early medium matches, I think. Yeah, he got a boost on the turn that the Scully beat went for protect. And Bengay passed plus 5 speed to Megina. And it's Z move Megina. Maybe it's. Oh, it's Z What? Z Twinkle Tackle? That did nothing. Yeah, I don't actually know if this is the real game. This is super weird. This is so weird. Okay, so he just put. um. Got damage on the Metagross to put it in range from Dagi. Oh, League just said uh, they decided before. Did they decide before if they would pair with each other, that it, uh, each other in semifinals that they would play immediately? And they didn't tell, okay. That's so weird. Yeah, this is not like his, it's the global moderator, it's not a fake old. So I think this game is real. Okay, I have to focus on my animation then. <laughs> Not mess it up. So I see that came out after the Magros got revenge. And there's no Krosma is probably... I don't have to set him a builder, but... I know that the Ladi is calm mind. I don't know if the Krosma is... I think there's no Krosma is like charge beam stored power. But that might have been that some a different baton best team. Ooh, Bengay the God goes into SP on the lead seed. I'm actually uploading um Malakith versus Lord Average at the moment and I just rechecked smoke and I saw this started. Wow, and that was like there's no way this is real. <laughs> So Dougie got rocks up and oh my god, I got brought onto the sash by Dragon Clone Reversal. Oko secure him how? How did that kill? Is that minus defense nature cure him? And that so much to sell to. I know it's 250 base power, but it's not stab. So he gets up a T-Spike with his Scully P and Malakis is just gonna spam Heavy Slam here. Gonna see Protect and then potentially a Substitute on the next turn to get more Speed Boosts. Into either... into what though? We will see, maybe into Ladi, maybe... One of the three Psychic types, obviously. Mm. We're gonna see Protect here again, pretty obvious plays. And if he's passing into a start power one, yeah, he's subbing up again and protecting him to get a plus six speed to maximize the power of stored power. He passed into Laddie. What did he say? Oops, forgot what happened. Oh, it goes for a reflector and he's still flying. What did he forget about? Fire Blast? He's getting Fire Blast this next turn. Oh, he's going killed. Wait, that was what? Charge beam, Larry. What can't Barry Kelly? What is what is happening? I don't understand anything. I thought this Kelly would have been Scarf. It's what can't Barry. So does the Celsius have another fire blast? Or why didn't he go for it? So many questions. Yeah, now he finally goes for this perfective Sacred Sword. It why is it... Why is it super effective? Oh, on the roost! It's super effective on the roost, because it loses the flying type. Good god, Malekith the gold. 
And oh my god, he earthquake on the ruse, but it, what did he predict there? It doesn't lose the levitate ability, obviously. That was odd. So this is charge beam reflector bruise. Ice beam, oh my god, I did not see that coming. <laughs> Finch said, okay, this is not real, lol. This might just be fake, fake game, but since they said they said monster and everything, it's real. In have fun. It's a prank. It's a prank. I don't know if it's a prank. Yeah, it could be a prank. So what happened here? We see roost. Okay, so this is steel flying type. So this can't even hit it. Besides focus bias and side shock, like even for side shock. He said. Probably whatever. So a steel flying laddie has just won this game for Ben Gay, but I'm not sure. Wait. Why does he say Reds on final? Stop trolling me, dude. Even if this is the real game, this was game one, right? Let me check the smoke to set the thread on OST. Pretty sure this is best of three still. So apparently this was already game two if it was real. So oh Bengay didn't want they win game one too. Oh he said trolled. Fuck off dude! I'm never recording with this guy again. This guy is trolling, good god. Yeah, I don't even know what's going on. It, like... What? Yeah, Benge, Benge already made the post, 1GG. So this was game 2 then, I didn't see game 1. Um, yeah, what the fuck. That's wild, they already played and I missed game 1. Dude, I was just gone for a few minutes making my thumbnail for the OST series from last round and they already played next round. There's no way, what the fuck? So he won't be taunt I don't know what he brought for game 1. Let me try to find out if I can see the replay. Yeah, I have the replay here so... Bengay bought the Tompas even in this other game, and Malakis also brought the same team, so... This is so odd, if this is real, I'm like... That caught me off guard, like, what the flip? Like, he just brought this game with this team in this series with Lord, Out Lord Outrage, and then he brought it again twice, like, let me just rewatch this real quick. So this Coco is, um, Reflect and Light Screen, and it has Taunt. So I could see the Earthquake coming out from the Landers predicting a Taunt. As Teal6 says, I have a brain confusion and need to know if this is real. I'm not memeing, I actually do. Oh, okay. So he got up the rocks, I saw that crane, or oh, Bengay might have gone for taunt, they're predicting that. Let's just go through this fast. Earthquake, that's 56. I don't want to pause it too much, I just want to get this done really quick. Taunt's there, which is a bit odd, because the rocks were already up. But he already had a both screen, so I guess he didn't really have much to do. So this this moves like I don't think it has attacking moves. I think it's oh it's barrier. I think it's barrier call my taunt. And then like baton pass. We got a crit on that. So he gets up a call mind and now he's gonna go for a roost if he has it or just hard baton pass. Yeah, just hard baton pass, so it doesn't have roost probably. Probably taunt baton pass. So start power on the cross will probably just wins this game from here. Charge be more. I think it's Charge Beam, I've seen this team, yeah. Oh, Rock Polish. So Rock Polish raises its speed and makes stored power stronger. But yeah, it's Charge Beam. That's 33, gets a special attack boost, good god. So I assume Bengi just 6 out with this. 
we'll see if this is it's not April Fools anymore. April Fools is over. Like I don't know. This I don't think this is a joke. I think Benga really just won. He already posted in from GG one or one GG and he's in OST finals. Um versus League is playing versus ABR. That's gonna be hype. This match is fun. Um so yeah, Benga is gonna be playing with the winner of that series. I see yeah, there's not much to know, he's just Setting up his Necrozma here, so he's actually taking the hits pretty well and then he gets a crit, which sucks, and he gets another raise. Ooh, not sure if this has Moonlight. Is that Rock Polish, Charge Beam, probably Star Power, and... I don't know if it has Moonlight, I think it has Moonlight, right? Star Power just misses out on the Oko Belly, but it's Iron Defense boosted, so Medium Edge doesn't even kill. Yeah, that crit, that crit was annoying on the... And he just said GG in forfeit. I think the crew was annoying, probably mad at on the Steeler, but I don't know if it would have changed the outcome of the game. So yeah, Bengay really like showing that he can bring the same teams and win. Like that was not the same team, it was like the same playstyle. Like Baton plays two games in a row. And yesterday he brought semi stall with Volk or however you want to call it, even full stall maybe. Not I would call it semi stall with Volk. So yeah, I'm here in the semi-finals OC thread and where Ben Gay said 1GG. Which makes me think it's real, but I'm not sure. Let me see. And Malekis answered, yeah, GG, you piece of shit. Because <laughs> he brought the Tom Beth twice. Let me like that. Um, nothing against Ben Gay. Yeah, let me just like that. It's a fun pose. Um, yeah, I'm still not sure 100% sure if this is real. But I will find out. If it's not real, I will probably just upload this for fun. Here you have the two pairings again, if you want to see it. I already mentioned it. ABR was Isle of League and Bengay Malekith. So, if this game was really Bengay versus ABR, Isle of League in finals. Winner gets 200 bucks. Winner of this tournament. And yeah, I hope you all enjoyed. Oh, yeah, this is wild. I haven't even <laughs> uploaded the quarterfinals game. And this is... Oh, they already played semifinals. Wild. Just... I don't know, I have to ask someone if this is real. Let me pause and ask. So yeah, I'm here in the lobby chat and apparently they're saying it was real, but it's not 100% sure. What the fuck happened? That was semis. That was... Someone said that was real. Where was it? Um... Yeah, wow. Well, they caught me off guard so much with this just playing immediately. Like uh, Usually out of league is they gotta play immediately when the games come out, but now Bengi and Malik has played. I probably talked to each other beforehand. Like I said earlier. So yeah, out of league said he's down for finals today. I is he talking about if he can play, if someone can convince ABR? I think he's talking about semi finals. Yeah, ABL likes to play early, then maybe we'll see Alphic with ABL later um, or in a few minutes. That will be hype. Mm. Good god, people getting the games done fast as fuck. Usually you see people like John till the last day, but not not, not anymore. Okay, Alphic said, um, ABL said Sunday is the earliest time. Today is uh, Thursday. Uh, I'm in Germany, it's Thursday here, it's Wednesday for you if you're in America. Yeah, so it's probably probably in a few days and then OST finals. Probably if you probably in like a week. Unless the winner of League and ABR wants to play immediately <laughs> after that semifinals game. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. This is confusing, but yeah. Apparently Ben Gay is in OST finals. So congratulations to Ben Gay. And peace out. <laughs> Good God. Yeah, what's up guys? I knew I should have waited a few minutes before I, like end the video and like a few minutes later I checked the uh, OST thread again and Ben Gay said that um, they're actually playing on on Monday. They're playing for real Monday 4 p.m. Eastern. So this was a fake game. I fell for the trap. Um, to be age, at some points I was like kind of sure that it's not real, like you guys see in the video. But 
I would rather record this and if it's fake it's fine but I would in case it was not fake I just had to record it and yeah I'm obviously just gonna upload this because it's kind of fun trolling myself because I was I can put in the title when you think you're recording OST semi-finals I don't know if I'm gonna put that in the title or if I'm gonna make people believe that it's real that would be fine now but people most people know by that check the thread or we will know that it's fake but that, this was still fun so I'm super glad that this is not real and we will see in the game on Monday and because that games were super fast and like eh like his brother same team twice and I just was like how what the fuck what is this you just use this team in the round versus all average why you can't just bring the same team twice again and get slaughtered okay <laughs> yeah yeah, and he also said, uh, said I got like almost double the likes in my fake post than in my quarters win one. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this will still be fun though, but hope you all enjoy. <laughs> and I'm super hyped for the series, for the actual week series, Bengi vs. Malakir. And peace out, friends. <laughs> this time the video is actually over. Yeah, peace.